Hey everybody, Iron Toast here. Thank you for watching, and this is your quick guide to using Stealth Suit Spider Man. Alright, so Stealth Suit Spider Man is a neat character design. Kabam gave him uh, multiple utilities, which, considering this uniform was provided by S.H.I.E.L.D., makes sense. Now you as the player can evaluate the fight ahead and choose a pre-fight ability to adjust for any counters you need. Uh, as well, his damage output can be pretty decent. Uh, and his awakened ability is not necessary in order to be usable, which is always nice. Um, it simply amps up his fury damage. So let's dive in. First off, an interesting quirk about Stealth Spider-Man, he has a 7 hit combo for medium, light, 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 medium. Uh, he's the first character we've seen with this so far. It takes a little getting used to. It's more neat than anything, but I suppose it could be a little extra helpful in those void fights. Right? So, like, he could shake two debuffs and three combos as opposed to the four combos that it would take any other champion. Uh, another thing to keep in the back of your mind is that Stealth Spidey also destroys Sinister Six tag champions. His base critical rating goes up to something like 75%. Anyway, the important thing you need to know, though, is about the pre-fight abilities. Uh, let's talk about the Flashbang. Now, this is the one that you go into the fight with if you don't specifically choose another one. Uh, Flashbang is your damage dealer. Uh, Flashbang allows you to put a vulnerability debuff on the opponent, which makes your critical hits about three times stronger. This ends the majority of fights rather quickly if you play it right. Uh, to use any web cartridge, you need to reel off four light hits in a row or connect with your special too. Uh, the, first, the first method is nice if you need your web cartridge ability in a pinch, uh, but you should wait for your special two whenever possible because the duration of the debuff is 250% or 150% longer, I guess, however you want to say it. Uh, for flashbang and web foam, that takes the duration from 12 seconds to about 30, which is quite significant. Uh, and the tranquilizer debuff goes from about four seconds to about nine. Um, you get five web cartridges in a fight, and if you use them up, you can use special three to replenish them all. Another cartridge type is the web foam. You will want to load up web foam when you're going up against an unstoppable or an evade opponent. Uh, when I bring web foam to a fight, what I like to do is fire a slow debuff off, um, off of the four light combo. Um, do this as needed to get your power bar up to two. Uh, be sure to save a cartridge for when you have your special two and get that longer debuff. And then while the long debuff is running, build your power to special 3 and replenish your charges. Uh, and then repeat that rotation as needed. This is a pretty powerful mechanic actually. Um, definitely practice this when you can. Maybe find a quest that has unblockable nodes and run through it. Um, the last type of cartridge is Tranquilizer. I use this one when absolutely necessary. The debuff only lasts about 4 seconds. Um, I've really just found this helpful for champions that you might need a little extra time to bait out specials, someone like, like say, Hyperion, um, who can be a pain sometimes. Um, nice to have this one available, but it doesn't see a lot of screen time uh, for me personally. And uh, that's pretty much the gist of it. As always, take time to read all of his abilities in full sometime um, to pick up on any of the finer points. Um, as far as synergies, Vulture and Electro are pretty decent. Vulture helps deal more damage to the opponent when you're using that Tranquilizer web cartridge. Again, not all that often. Uh, and then Electro increases the potency of Spider-Man's Fury and Precision buffs, which is quite good. Uh, I'd bring him if you have a spot on your squad, to be honest. Vulture, probably only sometimes. Uh, so thank you very much for watching. Do hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. I'd really appreciate it, and I will catch you next time.